when you discount the future cash flows of a project and bring it down to its present value, if the NPV that you arrive at is a positive number, it indicates that the project is generating a return which is higher than the discounting rate applied. And in case the NPV is negative, that means the project is earning lesser than the rate applied. But you would like to find out what is the internal rate of return of the project? How much is the project actually earning? So if I have to give you a formula for that, you will require two numbers. One discounting rate where the NPV is positive and the other where the NPV is negative. In this example, let's assume these are the cash flows from the project. You first discount it using a 15% rate and you arrive at a positive cash flow. We will call this the start rate. Then we apply a 20% and we get a negative cash flow, a negative NPV. We will call it the end rate. What are the characteristic of a start rate? You have a surplus. At the end rate, you have a deficit. Now, if you want to arrive at the IRR, you need to apply a simple formula. IRR is equal to start rate plus surplus divided by surplus plus deficit. Please note, deficit is a negative number, but you've got to add it. So start rate plus surplus divided by surplus plus deficit multiplied by the difference between start and end rate. In this case, the difference between 15 and 20 percent. So the Start rate is 15% plus 48,400, which is the surplus at 15%, divide by surplus plus deficit, 48,000 plus 12,000, multiplied by the difference. This gives you an IRR of 19% in this case.